So I'm gonna go ahead and cut these nasty ones off and put the new plates on there. So I have this F-150 here. This is the one that I actually just finished up the bed set on. This one actually also got a frame replacement. Our mechanic already put a new used frame underneath it. But somebody replaced these inputs before and clearly did a horrible job. So we bought new end plates for each side. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut these nasty ones off and put the new plates on there. I have these plates roughly sitting in place. I'm getting our measuring system out. I'm gonna measure this frame and I'm gonna first match this turtle to the truck. So I'll go to five points in the center of the truck and that'll match this to the truck. And then I could come up here and measure exactly where these are supposed to sit because you can see here, I could put them in all types of different angles and I wanna make sure they're sitting exactly where they're supposed to. So I'll use the measuring system to do that. Now I could come up to the front of this. It knows exactly where the truck is sitting right now. And I can make my measurements. And it has me go to the top part of this hole. Now this one's sitting about five millimeters back too far. So I'm gonna scoot this forward some. I got these sitting pretty damn close. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna put some clamps on them and I'm gonna recheck them. All right, now everything is within three millimeters, which is plenty within tolerance of the full frames on these. So I'm gonna go ahead and weld these plates on, on all three sides there. I always want to protect this ladder because if you get anything on this track, it'll mess it up and throw off the measuring system. I'm going to head and threw some tack welds on there first, just so I could get my vice grips out of my way. And now I'm going to go through and lay down my beads. 